When you picture a butterfly, you probably imagine a delicate, harmless beauty fluttering among flowers. But what if I told you some butterflies are hiding a dark, dangerous secret? Today, Papillon Chateau is diving into the wild side of butterflies, the ones that aren't just beautiful but deadly. We'll uncover how some butterflies become toxic, and even how a few can unleash chemical weapons. From caterpillars that eat poisonous plants to butterflies that can release cyanide gas, yes, really, nature's most elegant insects are also some of its most cunning survivors. So grab a snack, but maybe skip the milkweed, and get ready for some surprising, even shocking butterfly facts. Let's get started! First up, the monarch. North America's most iconic butterfly, a true symbol of transformation and resilience. Monarchs are instantly recognizable and for good reason. Their wings are a masterpiece of nature, painted in vibrant orange and bold black, with delicate white spots along the edges. These striking colors make monarchs stand out wherever they go, fluttering through meadows and gardens. But those colors aren't just for show, they're a warning. Monarchs are toxic, and their appearance is a bold announcement to the world. Stay away! As caterpillars, monarchs have a very particular diet. They feed exclusively on milkweed, a plant that's loaded with cardenolides, potent chemicals that are poisonous to most animals and insects. Instead of getting sick, monarch caterpillars have evolved to store these toxins in their bodies. This remarkable adaptation turns them into living poison, making them unappetizing and even dangerous to would-be predators. When they undergo their incredible transformation and emerge as butterflies, the toxins remain locked inside their bodies. This means that even as adults, monarchs carry their chemical defense with them wherever they go. If a bird or other predator tries to eat a monarch, it gets a mouthful of bitter, toxic chemicals. The experience is so unpleasant that the predator often vomits and quickly learns to avoid monarchs in the future. Monarchs use their bright colors as a warning sign, a strategy called aposematism. It's nature's way of saying, eat me and you'll regret it. This visual warning is a powerful tool in the animal kingdom. The effectiveness of this warning is remarkable. Predators quickly learn to associate the monarch's orange and black pattern with a nasty experience, and soon they won't even bother to try. Monarchs have turned their food source into a shield and their beauty into a weapon. Their entire survival strategy is built around this unique relationship with milkweed and the toxins it provides. Their survival depends on milkweed. Without it, they lose their toxic defense. Monarchs lay their eggs only on milkweed, ensuring the next generation is just as well protected. That's why protecting milkweed is crucial for monarch conservation. By planting milkweed in gardens and wild spaces, we can help support monarch populations and preserve this incredible natural defense system. Next time you see a monarch, remember, behind that beauty is a powerful story of survival, adaptation and chemical warfare. Every fluttering wing is a testament to millions of years of evolution. Even the most delicate creatures can be the most dangerous. Monarchs may look fragile, but they are armed with one of nature's most effective defenses. Monarchs are true survivors. Nature's toxic royalty, reigning over fields and gardens with their unmistakable colors and unyielding spirit. Their wings aren't just pretty, they're a warning billboard, advertising their danger to the world and keeping them safe from harm. In the world of butterflies, looks really can kill. Monarchs prove that sometimes, the most beautiful creatures are also the most formidable. Monarch butterflies are famous for their striking orange and black wings, which serve as a bold warning to would-be predators. These colors aren't just for show. They're a survival strategy, signaling that monarchs are toxic and not worth the risk of a taste. Their warning colors are so effective, in fact, that other butterflies want in on the action. Enter the Viceroy butterfly, a master of disguise in the insect world and a true artist when it comes to survival. At first glance, viceroys look almost identical to monarchs. They've evolved to mimic the monarch's orange and black pattern so closely that even experienced bird predators, and sometimes even humans, struggle to tell them apart. This clever mimicry is their ticket to safety. This phenomenon is called Batesian mimicry. In this evolutionary trick, a harmless species copies the appearance of a harmful or unpalatable one to avoid being eaten. The viceroy, once thought to be completely harmless, was believed to be the ultimate pretender, riding on the monarch's dangerous reputation. Predators who have had a bad experience with a monarch quickly learn to steer clear of anything sporting those warning colors. As a result, viceroys enjoy a cloak of protection, 
even though they don't share the monarch's potent toxins. At least that's what scientists used to think. But here's the twist. Viceroys aren't completely harmless after all. Recent research has revealed that they have their own chemical defenses. Viceroy caterpillars feed on willows and poplars, plants that contain bitter chemicals. By storing these compounds in their bodies, viceroys become distasteful to predators too, making them less appetizing than once believed. This discovery changes the story. Monarchs and viceroys are both unpalatable, and their shared warning colors create a mutual defense system. This is known as Mullerian mimicry, where two or more harmful species evolve to look alike, reinforcing the stay away message to predators. By sharing the same warning colors, both species benefit. Predators learn even faster to avoid anything with that orange and black pattern, making the message stronger and more effective for everyone involved. It's a brilliant example of nature's deception and cooperation, where survival depends on teamwork as much as trickery. The line between mimic and model blurs, making the orange and black pattern a universal sign of danger in the butterfly world. This shared signal confuses predators and keeps both species safer. Even scientists were fooled for years by this clever act, only recently uncovering the true nature of the Viceroy's defenses. In the butterfly world, survival is about more than just being poisonous. It's about playing the ultimate game of look-alike, blending in and outsmarting your enemies at every turn. Monarchs and Viceroy's prove that in nature, imitation isn't just flattery, it's a lifesaver, and sometimes, it's the key to thriving in a world full of hungry predators. Their partnership is a masterclass in evolutionary strategy, showing how two species can work together, intentionally or not, to outwit their enemies. Sometimes, the best defense in nature isn't just being dangerous, it's having a really convincing costume and knowing how to wear it well. Now, let's meet a butterfly that takes toxicity to the next level. The pipevine swallowtail. With shimmering blue and black wings, it's stunning and seriously dangerous. As caterpillars, they feed on pipevine plants packed with aristolochic acids, potent toxins that can cause cancer and kidney failure. Pipevine swallowtails store these toxins in their bodies, making them deadly to predators and even risky for humans to handle. Their toxicity is so notorious that other butterflies like the spice bush and black swallowtails mimic their appearance for protection. This creates a whole mimicry complex with many species copying the pipevine swallowtail's warning colors. The caterpillars themselves are bold with dark bodies and bright spikes, another aposematic signal. Don't touch me. The entire life cycle of the pipevine swallowtail revolves around this toxic defense from egg to adult. The female lays eggs only on pipevine plants, ensuring her offspring inherit this chemical shield. It's a dramatic example of coevolution plant and butterfly locked in a high-stakes partnership. The pipevine swallowtail is a true gothic queen, beautiful, mysterious and deadly. Admire its beauty but respect its power. In the world of butterflies, the most dazzling colors often hide the deadliest secrets. This is nature's dark elegance at its finest. Think butterflies can't get any wilder? Think again! While we often picture butterflies and moths as delicate, harmless creatures fluttering through meadows, some of their relatives have evolved into true survival specialists. Meet the Zygenidae, Bernay and Forester moths, nature's cyanide bombers. These moths are not just beautiful, they're armed with one of the most potent chemical defenses in the insect world. Their metallic, brightly colored wings aren't just for show. These moths don't just store poison. They can actually release hydrogen cyanide gas when threatened, turning themselves into living chemical weapons. As caterpillars, they feed on plants loaded with cyanide compounds or even manufacture cyanide themselves. This means their bodies are laced with toxins from the very beginning, making them unappetizing to most would-be predators. When danger strikes, these moths mix chemicals stored in their bodies to create a sudden puff of deadly gas. This cloud of hydrogen cyanide can stun, repel or even kill predators instantly, giving the moth a chance to escape. This isn't just passive defense, it's active chemical warfare. The moths can even raise their wings and display their colors as a warning, signaling to predators that they're not to be messed with. Their warning colors are a bold announcement, mess with me and you'll pay the price. These vivid reds, blues and metallic sheens are nature's way of saying, danger, stay away. Every stage of their life, egg, caterpillar, chrysalis, adult is laced with cyanide. 
Even their eggs and chrysalises are toxic, protecting them from hungry insects and birds. Even their slow, confident flight is a sign. They have nothing to fear. Unlike most moths that dart away at the slightest threat, Zygenidae move with a calm assurance, knowing their chemical arsenal keeps them safe. Predators quickly learn to avoid these living chemical weapons. One bad encounter is usually enough to teach a bird or spider to steer clear for life. The Zygenidae are a reminder that nature's most beautiful creatures can also be its most dangerous. Their elegance hides a deadly secret, making them both admired and respected in the wild. Their cyanide defense is a marvel of evolution, a tiny insect with the power to gas its enemies. This adaptation has helped them survive for millions of years, outsmarting predators at every turn. It's a humbling example of how much power can be packed into a small, colorful package. These moths prove that size isn't everything when it comes to survival. Next time you see a bright moth, remember, it might be a master of chemical warfare. That flash of color could be a warning, not just a decoration. Insects like these break all the stereotypes, gentle on the outside, lethal on the inside. Their beauty is matched only by their ingenuity and their ability to defend themselves. Nature's creativity knows no bounds. From camouflage to chemical warfare, evolution has equipped even the smallest creatures with astonishing tools for survival. Sometimes, the smallest creatures have the biggest surprises. The next time you spot a moth, take a closer look. You might just be looking at one of nature's most extraordinary survivors. So, are you seeing butterflies differently now? From toxic monarchs and their clever mimics to deadly pipevine swallowtails and cyanide-releasing moths, these insects are true survivors. They're not just pretty. They're masters of chemical warfare and deception. Nature is full of surprises and even the most familiar creatures can have hidden powers. Thanks for joining Papillon Chateau on this wild journey. Let us know which butterfly fact blew your mind in the comments. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to subscribe on YouTube and follow on Facebook for more interesting videos from Papillon Chateau. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring. And remember, at Papillon Chateau, every wing tells a story.